Boys, if we're going to smash 35 likes for the first episode of Bargain Ballers, that would be so sick. Anyway, let's get into this episode. It is the first episode of Bargain Ballers. Hello, lads. Welcome back to another video on the channel. Now, today, we do have the first episode of Bargain Ballers. The first of many to come because this series can hopefully help out loads of you guys. Ultimately, we just review players who are literally cheap beasts. Every Wednesday, a new Bargain Baller episode will come out on the channel. So, yeah, if you're not subscribed... Subscribe and you know just in case if YouTube mess up again just click the notification bell just so you don't miss a video But yeah, I'm pretty excited for the series as well We're just literally reviewing cheap beasts going into a few games with them making a graphic for their player profile and Yeah, so yeah, that was the introduction to bargain ball It's gonna be a very consistent very consistent series within the channel so yeah, hopefully many more to come. Without further ado, let's get into Bargain Ballers episode 1. The first Bargain Baller on the channel is indeed Rabiot. As you can see here, we've created a nice little graphic which basically sums up this card overall within his price, in-game stats, the, the lot. Already looking at his base card, we can see the stats are very well maintained, very well all-rounded card, whether that be box to box midfielder or, you know, kind of sweeping CDM midfielder. This guy can pretty much play anywhere midfield unless you're going forward, like, as a central attacking midfielder. Um, but yeah, he can definitely play that DM role and box to box role. But yeah, there is base stats getting into some more in games. We do have free star, free star again, which isn't awful. That, like, EA could have just been a dick and just choke and remove free star weak foot for two star. And it's instantly unusable, but free star, free star. It is, um, I mean, for no more than 2,000 coins, which we'll get into in a minute. Like, you, you really can't complain. He's also left-footed as well. Um, I did forget to put on the graphic. He's left-footed, okay? Just so you know. Um, and, yeah, he's also six foot four, And he's got a work rate of medium, medium. Anyway, getting into the alternatives in the bottom left hand of the graphic. These are basically alternatives to Rabiot who are a lot more expensive. So, the somewhat more cheaper version of Rabiot is going to be Sissoko. Um, he's coming at roughly around 30k, I think. Obviously, with Sissoko, he's got five-star weak foot as well, which kind of does offer that, and the Premier Links. But Rabiot, again, if you look at the base stat, like there's really not a difference like maybe the physicals and a little bit of pace um but yeah like again you're saving yourself like over 25k so you can't really complain the super alternative for rabiot is gonna be paul pogba and he's roughly like 200k boys um obviously paul pogba is five star five star it's pogba it's premier league links um but yeah if you are looking to kind of get if you need a French midfielder and you're like, oh, nah, but Pogba's loads, just Rabiot. Just for the time being, whack Rabiot and he's going to do the job. The beastly alternative to Rabiot is going to be N'Golo Kante. Obviously, Kante's around 300k, so, I mean, yeah, I mean, some people may not have that at this stage of the year, but Rabiot, again, if you need, if you need a, if you need a French, if you need any French DM for that fact, use Rabiot, okay? No more than 2k, he's going to save your pocket. Then getting into his spicy stats, we do have short passing 84, ball control 84, and strength 82. Again, these just sum the card up, really. He's very well composed on the ball with the ball control short pass and again very well composed and strength is very good as well and that's without a chem star if you work an anchor on him it's going to boost his pace boost his defender boost his physical and yeah he'll be even better than what that looks like now that's not at least the price we will go into now on xbox and ps4 again the prices are very similar um he's no more than 2k and this is when he's flared up i picked him up for 1000 coins no more than 2000 coins like if you don't and you need a french dm what are you doing get rabiot in your team well if i ever do let's get into some of the clips we got of rabiot whilst playing games boys get into the first clip as you can see i am on the attack and arrivals game i'm lacking options rabiot sweeps in being a box box midfielder he is jukes up the defender with a nice little turn with his Sick agility. Rodrigo then does the rest of the work. And yeah, Rabiot gets a cheeky assist to his name. 2-0. Guys, getting into the second clip now of Rabiot. And this clip is a prime example of why he's pressing so important within that midfield. As you can see there, Bully's defender wins it back. Slots it through to, to Rodrigo, sorry. Rodrigo then, all he has to do is finish. And he misses. But Rabiot again, with the high work and the high pressing to win that ball within the midfield from kickoff is why you need him in your team. Lads, within this next clip, we are going to see a prime example again of Roy Rabiot. Cutting them passing lanes as a DM is very important. They're on the counter-attack after they've just missed an opportunity and Rabiot again sweeps in and deals with the damage. Within this clip, boys, I was actually playing Rabiot as a box box midfielder and as you can see there, like I said, very fortunate. Plays into die by Rabiot does Rabiot making that run and look at this on his weak foot. Oh, and he's hit the post, but still. On his weak foot, that's a cracking attempt. Lads, it is the 120th minute against Ben Hopkins. And yeah, as we see here, Jordi Abbey gets the ball. Down to Laurenti, down to the new one to watch card. Rabiot then runs down the wing as a box box midfielder. Ben thinks we're going to cut in. No, he doesn't. Wang Han Chan. 
And he's hit it straight to keep it, but Rabiot again with that cross. And last but not least, against Ben Hopkins. To win the game, Rabiot steps up as the fifth penalty taker. And Rabiot can keep his composure to beat the one and only Mr. Hopkins within a FIFA game. Rabiot's going to bang it in top left, and it's a goal. Rabiot wins it, and Ben Hopkins is in the mud. And yeah, as you can see there, that sums up Rabiot, a very well composed man within FIFA 21. So yeah, a very well composed, well maintained, all round beast within that midfield for no more than 2,000 coins. Go get yourself Rabiot from Piemonte Calcio within FIFA 21. Anyway, that has been the first episode of Bargain Ballers. Please like, comment and subscribe. And yeah, next Wednesday, we are back with another Bargain Ballers. Tune in to see who we actually are going to be reviewing. I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.